And welcome back, still in Irafil. Gonna go for the uh, Aldrich Saint of the Deep in Anorlondo next, uh, as I said last time. When I decided to cut the recording short, because I accidentally paused the recording and didn't want to waste too much time lining it up again. So let's do this. Uh, we've got to go to Pontiff Sullivan. Good old Sullivan. I say good old, he was a tyrant, more than about. Oh, uh, I scratched a scratch card during the little break I had just then. I was a little break. Uh, I, I won a whole two pounds. So yeah, I'm unstoppable. Totally got to take that to the shop tomorrow. Well, tomorrow. I, for you, it will be like yesterday at this point. I think. I don't know what day it is. Let's go forward. I've got a cool, a much cooler cape. Whoosh. There's Arch Dragon Peak. Go there later. Yeah, one of them always gets away from me, but I could just reload the area to bring them back, but I, I can't be asked. It's not worth the slight energy it would take. Well, that's always a pleasant sight. Bunch of dead giants. You know what? Uh, I am actually going to put one of these back on because I like being able to be just a little bit reckless. The downside to play the modded PC version is I got I got a bit used to the um, fact that poise actually works better. I like how it just flattens them. It's delightful. <laughs> I was saying in my Space Marine video earlier, wasn't I, that I would love to see a uh, Space Marine style hum. Um, well, a Warhammer style Dark Souls like game. Well, a Souls like with Warhammer stuff. I want to go this way before I go that way. Because there's stuff up here. Ow! Or. Oh. First of all, let's uh, send that down. Just sit there. He, he he wanted to die. That one wanted to die. He had enough. He caught his wife cheating on him with another rock lizard. One of the big ones from the uh, Arch Dragon Peak. And he realised he couldn't compete with that. He couldn't compete with Gary the Rock Lizard. There's a lot of Garys around here, but he was the Rock Lizard Gary. He couldn't compete with him. And his job as a salesman. So he, he, he let me kill him. It was a mercy, really. Okay. Kia. <laughs> Gotta be careful, because that one grab attack they do can kill you. Oh, symbol of Avarice. Also known as anything produced by the AAA game industry. Ha ha ha. Real hot take that was, wasn't it? Yeah, okay, it's not original, but fuck it. It's not like it's not relevant. Greedy bastards. Anyway. Anyway. Pushing forward. That looks awesome. Just a uh, public service announcement there that it looks awesome. Or a little nightmares game set in the bloody uh, Dark Souls universe. That would uh, be quite thema thematically uh, consistent. You 
just like your six, but she's got like a suit of armor. Now you'd be a new character. His, we'll call him Eleven, or him or her. No, we'll go her because again, female protagonist. That's my bag. We'll call her Eleven, or Ash. We'll call her Ash, like because Dark Souls Ash. It's funny, and uh, and uh, she'll always have a little sword that she can use, but like. Because of her size, it would be like a sort of combination of Dark Souls and a Shadow of the Colossus sort of style game. And I, I'm saying all this as a joke, but the more I say it, the cooler it sounds to me. And I want to be careful, because I will have just pissed off a couple of dudes here. There's these random Drang Knights who do their thing. <laughs> Didn't expect that to work, to be honest. I, I half expected them to just, like, uh, biff me and break me out of it. <laughs> That's the quickest I've ever dealt with them. Fantastic. Uh, they dropped his Drown Twin Spears. They're quite cool. I could kill some of the giants down there. Should I? Don't see why not. Just to remember which ones are. I think you can lock onto the ones that are real. No, it's that one that's real. Yeah, it is. You just want attack where you start spazzing out. That's what you want. Ow! That's not what you want. You don't want to get stepped on. This is why you want that, because... Ow! You motherless whore! I'm gonna go through most of my Estus here. Look, I know I've got the uh, whole rigor Sacrifice thing. Okay, um, I didn't know they could do that. Again, I kind of just wanted to start spazzing out because it's the easiest to think to do. I think he has to have a certain amount of health loss first. <laughs> Hit him in the face. Now, while ago I was working on this thing, it wasn't anything fancy, I was just uh, taking Dark Souls clips I recorded and uh, mashing them up to go with the song This Is War by uh, 30 Seconds to Mars. I'm going to have to continue that because well, I enjoyed putting that together, that was fun. I'm going to put that put more of that together. Mostly I was, I was using just footage from Dark Souls 3 because when I started doing it I only had Dark Souls 3 and, well, I couldn't be asked to fix it. Fix it. Uh, you know, I couldn't be asked to go back and start recording new footage. You remember when I keep when I I think it was in this this playthrough where I accidentally pressed that circle button to let go of the ladder, thinking it would slide me down. Okay, I need some sort of range weapon here. I can't get beyond without this. Oh, that really weighs me. Yeah, I knew that was the wrong arrow. Oops, stuck the corner. I think these things used to be people. Like actual people. 
That was the wrong choice. That was the very much the wrong choice. Um, yeah, at least I've got some souls though, so. And I haven't really lost anything. Because, well. Really a sacrifice, love. Let's go and spend those souls so that I don't lose them and get angry. Uh, I want to avoid that. I, I remember when I was doing the cathedral bit, I was getting really pissed off with the rafters. Uh, I, I said some very colourful things that I did end up cutting out of the uh, cutting out of the actual video because I thought, even by my standards, some of the stuff I said was a bit too much. Um, it happens when I get angry. I don't mean a lot of what I say, but this is why I won't do a video live. I will leave it to your imagination, the sort of things I can say when I'm really angry. Okay, we'll leave that to your imagination. Welcome speak. Very good. Hey. I need to give her a soul. I don't need to. I could ignore. I could not. Farewell, yeah. Ashen One. Ten luck. That should help. Am I hollow? Not yet. No, I'm, I'm good. I need to reposition myself. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're good. Uh, I wanted to buy something specific, actually, but I can't remember what it was. I mean, I did want to buy the Black Iron set at some point, but at this point it's just a waste of souls. Uh, Horace's set? I can buy Horace's set. Again, don't need it, though. It's funny, I like the look of that dagger, but I never use it. Apply a bleeding effect. The lacerating effect. Yeah, let's get some of that. Ashen. I don't want to lose too many souls, is the thing. That's why I want to spend as many of them as I can now. Henri, my beautiful friend, do you want to upgrade my swords for me? Uh, no, first of all. Excellent. Uh, reinforced weapon. Titanite chunk. Okay. I will do my other Zvihanda. Infuse. What should we infuse that one with? Uh, crystal? No. Um, let's do Blessed. Pretty that way I can blessed. switch to it if I need to have a sword that heals me over time. There you go. Perfect. I don't know why I did that. You know, I don't mind losing four grand of souls, that's nothing. Let's try this bit again, this time with feeling. You know there was this parody of Under the Sea, but Bioshock themed? That was fun. I'll find that again. There's a lot of fun stuff on the internet, isn't there? I'm back for you. You cheated on him up there, mate. You cheated on the other rock lizard. And, well, I had to punish you for it. That was the one that went to be with Gary, but eventually Gary kicked her out again. Because he knew that she would betray him one day as well. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know why any of that came out of my mouth, but it did. I don't remember what that is, and I can't be asked to figure it out. Oh, let's leave the artillery up there. Um. I don't need a cover though, so it's okay. The reason I want to kill those beasts down there is because you get a checkpoint if you do it. So that's why I'm trying to do this bit. I don't think I need that one. What would be a good one? Um, in the Cinder's mod you can get this ring that applies a... Uh, what do you call it? Um, 
special effect to your weapon that lets it do, do frostbite damage. It's pretty cool. So much of the stuff in that mod should have been in this game, in, in the base game. It's so cool. Now, some of the stuff was a real power fantasy sort of thing, but it was pretty cool. He's coming for me. I'm just going to say, I feel like you should have hit me there. Oh. I was going to put that lacerating stuff on, wasn't I? And I completely forgot. There we go, that's one of them. That's a lot of souls. I ain't risking it. Um, I don't think the lacerating thing will do much good against them, to be honest, because you need much better luck than I have to make use of it. And fire doesn't seem to really bother them much either. Um, screw it. As I say, if I can do this bit right, I will only I will have a checkpoint. Did not time that right. There we go. I'm healing a bit too much, I think. I'm dead. The button mashing did nothing. God fucking shit ass damn it. I don't like these things. <laughs> Sorry, I just saw a post that says I won't be eating soil and no. Back in the 70s, there was a movie called Soylent Green. It was set in 2022. I will not be eating fake meat. Okay. That amused me. I've still got a lot of souls there. I don't want to lose them. So we're going to put one more ring on. Um, so that I don't. This bit's taken me a while because of these bloody creatures. How long has it taken me? Uh, nearly 20 minutes. God damn. Okay. It's just firehander, that's the problem. It's to get the best attack, I've got to really build it up. Now, I'm really glad I do this bit offline because you'd have all sorts of other players invading to try and murder you. The Aldrich Fateful. The I mean, law-wise, it makes sense. They, they, they're here to make sure you don't um, make it to Aldrich and do your job, but they can piss off. <laughs> I've made my stance on invaders quite clear in the past, I believe. 
that they can fucking do one. Okay, um, you know what? Fuck it. Oh, yeah, and that. A boost to health is a good thing. Somehow that missed. I don't think somebody's attack should be missing the way they miss, I'm just saying. I want to do this again. I have to that. No, I got it. There you go. And that's quite a good ring to have, so let's put that on now. Ring of Favor. Gives me a boost to stamina, health, and some, I think, damage resistance, I think. Hold on, let's read it again. I say read it again. Let's uh, read it properly. Equip load, that's it. Uh, that's where you can join the Aldrich Faithful. I'm not going to do it because I don't have anything to gain from it. Let's uh, let's firelink shrine this real quick and spend some of those souls because I don't want to keep going through with a bloody uh, ring of sacrifice on. It's quite, you know, I don't want to do that. I know I, li I like the rectus stuffs, but I don't want to keep losing them. Alright, I bet I get like one level up out of it. Let's have a look. Yeah, I'm gonna get one level up out of it. Welcome host. Very good. Alright, let's do this. Now what am I gonna level up? Uh chick chick. Screw it, health. Farewell, Ash and me. That's better. The the water reserve, the reservoir. Or... I didn't read that. I didn't read that. The bastard sword. It never knew its father. I used the bastard sword for quite a while at well, one playthrough. I liked it, it was a cool sword. God damn it, this takes ages. Why couldn't there have been a lift here? I suppose that's the drawback to having this uh, safe one bit here. You don't have to worry about enemies, but um, it does take a while. Bit of balance, I suppose. And uh, if this bit's fun, because it's, it's like the first game. It's got like medals on it. Oh, it's, got, oh, it's got little like seals on it, okay. Just stay mobile. Like, these guys are really dedicated to their job, aren't they? Like multiple links of fire, they're still here. I 
I don't have to kill them. I, I'm happy enough for them to just be out of the way. Yeah, I've got the uh, serpent ring on. There you go. Again, I'm fine just having him out of the way. like these guys. I think they look cool. I like the little wings on their helmet. <laughs> Drop the titanite shard for me. I still need the uh, damn pontiff crown, don't I? Right, I've got nothing to throw at him. Hold on. Hang on a second. He's coming at me. sword in this game, which is sad, because I think it looks cool. <laughs> Sorry. Like, I, I, this sword really punishes them. Even my claymore didn't give them this sort of trouble. But, uh, you know, overall, with this right hander, I've made a good choice. Silver Knight Shield, they're quite cool. Does, I'm pretty sure it doesn't give you a special effect, but I'm going to read it anyway. Uh, parry, Silver Knight, protect them. Bless, her blessing upon their Knight Shield remains. Okay. So I don't think it does anything specific. At least it's not as brutal as the first game that is Get Tanorondo. Because those Silver Knights could bugger the hell off. Oh dear, I don't think I've done this right because the Pilgrim is not there who's meant to guide Armory. Yeah, this hasn't. I haven't done something right, have I? I think I've messed up the quest. I'll go to Anorondo and we'll try this again in a minute. Okay? Okay. But I got the armor I wanted. Brass leggings. There we go. Now I just need a shield to go with it because that shield does not go with this in the slayers. I think I need the Sunset Shield, that's going to be the one to get. So going for Aldrich here is probably the best idea. I need a shield though, I, I feel naked without a shield. What would actually work with the armor? Is that one? Eh, not really. No, no. Yeah, it's not. It's better than nothing. Sunset shield is definitely the way to go. little bonfire. At least there's none of those giant dickheads who are... Let's quickly go back to... Actually, the Church of Yorkshire I could, I could just walk to. Because it's literally right there. If 
But if I, um, anyway, sorry, I was about to say something earlier and I sort of trailed off as I do. If I defeat, um, what's his dick, um, Aldrich, that's him, got it right. If I defeat Aldrich, the devourer of gods, I can get a, uh, I can trigger another bit of a quest to go forward. I'm worried I screwed up the Lord of Hollows thing. I think I might have to go back to speak to Yuria. Name thyself, I am Yorshka, captain of the Dark Moon Knights. She got a tail. What beckoned thee to such a place? Thou thinks too. Very well. Captain to this knightless company I remain. I will grant thee pub. Basically, she's going to be my boss now. Thou journeyed so far. Arms. Hear my voice. If thou shalt swear by the covenant to become a shadow of Father Gwyn and Sister Guinevere, a blade that shall hunt the foes of our lords, then I place thee under the aegis and the power of the Dark Moon. There we go. I'm, I've now got the covenant. Well, hold Thou on. art now a blade of the Dark Sorry. Moon, the only knight of our company. Swear this oath and face thy solemn duty. There we go. Oh. Good. If I can provide thee succor, long ago, our father, oh, yes, Gwyn, lamenting the waning of the fire, became cinder of his own will. Now, the fire is linked by the champions who have come in his stead. Such is the will of father and the gods. And so the Dark Moon Knights took arms to watch over those who link the fire. But long ago, our company lost its last proper knight. Only its covenant was preserved to this day. Until the time of thy visit. Erdem taketh many forms, indeed. Off so soon, may the dark moon... Right, yeah, I just want to quickly go down there and deal with this bit. Depending on the... How long have I been doing this for now? Because, again, I don't want it to be too long. Yeah, um... I don't think I'll go for much longer. Like, I'm going to try and trigger the armory thing. Uh, but then, if I fail that... Or succeed at if I do one of the two things, I will stop because I, I have, I've got to start putting these videos together. I'm a bit behind now. They are painting guardian stuff. Uh, don't want to fall too far. That's what I didn't want to happen. That's upsetting. <laughs> what were my souls like? I don't. I wasn't paying attention to that. I bet I'm hollow now. You never know that that that, that little um, thing might have kickstarted the quest, but I'm still gonna have to double check all of this. Did I sort that fire out? I did. Ugh. Oh god, it's like a jelly baby that was melted in a, in a microwave. I'm not gonna... Clomp. Okay, that down there. Uh, clomp. 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 Some more rafters to drop onto, weren't there? Yeah, those ones there. Clomp, clomp, clomp. Clomp, clomp. There we go. Okay. Perfect. So the pilgrim's gone. Um, we might need to speak to Yuria to make sure this is all gone properly. If 
for I don't believe it has. That might have been the whole Orbeck thing, actually. I might have, because he lived, I might have screwed that one up. There she is. Speak her. on. Ah, great good tiding. The time is ripe. The boy awaits thee. So thou mayst. Uh, tell okay, me. I just had to. I just had to talk to her again. Okay. Let's make myself look cute again. It's a must. Mine. Yeah, let's drop a quick level up while we're here. Screw it. Welcome, husband. Then take. Hey, what should I go for this time? No. Let's up my strength a bit. Farewell, there Ashen we One. Back to it. Uh, yeah, that's the closest one. So we'll go to the marriage thing, and that's the end of this episode sorted. To check that out. So something on one of my Facebook pages. Uh, I'll, I'll say another day. I think that's the biggest. That's this armor, I think. Uh, hang on. No. Because I, I just keep seeing that uh, curse thing going down. So, There we go. I need to get my Pontiff crown soon. I might have to spend a little while on this without recording just to grind for it. Because again, I, I, I can't imagine that'd be interesting to watch. Just me killing the same knights over and over again for a shot at getting a, getting a crown. Don't need to bring weapons to a wedding, do I? Welcome, our gracious lord. Your spouse awaits you. You are very near. Please take the sword of a vow. May you be the truest lord of Londor. Thank you. Yours may you. Okay, cool. This is where you fight Gwendolyn in the first game, I think. If you choose to go that route. I I think. I could be wrong. I don't think I've ever done that, actually. I might have to do that at some point. I just don't enjoy going through the first game or, the, uh, or anything as much as the other one. Okay, let's do this. Because this is an appropriate wedding ceremony, isn't it? If you don't do this, you can um, help Henri defeat Aldrich in his or her world, and then they go hollow and you have to kill them later, but you know. You know. Now I can buy the Elite Knight set, which is good. There's a chest over here. I just want to grab this before we end the video. Ring of Reversal. It just makes me move like a man if I want to. Don't know why I would, but you never know. So right, that's the end of this episode. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Uh, I think that's the last video for today. Um, yeah. Ta-ta, it's Broad Gamer, signing off.